Hello and welcome to the NBA Show Plays. I am your host, Thomas Sanzo, and joining me today is Jacob. Hey, everybody. Oh, boy, it's been a long time. Yep, yep. Um, In today's Let's Play, we are going to continue on with the um very popular free-to-play Guild Wars 2. Um, fortunately for me, or, or unfortunately for me, uh, there's a major update, right? <laughs> yeah, well, somewhat. Also, uh, you forgot to put the share screen back on. Uh, oh, yeah, for, for you, for, for you, Jacob. Yes, not the audience at home. <laughs> but anyway, <laughs> um, yeah, kind of. Like right now, we're on the splash screen saying the logos and whatnot. But yes, um, for the audience at home, we're going to continue on with the gameplay, I think. I'm not 100% sure. So, I'm just going to get into gameplay now. And here's some lovely music. But at the same time too, uh, Jacob, what changed? What's updated? Well, the new expansion came out like uh, about a month ago or something like that. And one of the big changes is that, well, uh, hold on, the share screen is not working. Really? It should be working. I'm just in brown. You're just in brown. Do you see it now? Mm, no. No? Oh, wait. Technical interpreters. This is how we roll. Is it on now? Still seeing brown. Really now? That's odd. Oh boy. But mm, let, let's just see. Let's just see. Um. Huh. Should be working on my end. It's just seeing brown. Looks like gameplay's on here. All right. Uh, try. Okay. Uh, for try turning it back on and off again by um ending the call and rejoining the call. See if that works. <laughs> All right. So I I'll just entertain people at home. So anyway, um. Hey, welcome back. Is it working now? Yeah. Hold on, it's loading. Should be. I think. Oh no. Oh, there's a nest over there. I wonder what that is. Okay, there we go. Alright, there we go. Okay, you were saying? Right. So one of the big major things that changed with the new expansion is that you can now uh, use weapons that you could previously only use when you unlocked a very specific uh, elite spe specialization. So, uh, for me, for example, uh, for my uh, two spe specialization, uh, I normally cannot use shields, uh, axes, or daggers as, uh, well, uh, this character. All right. But now I can. So, as you can see, I got an S here. So, I got completely different abilities because, well, the main the elite specialization sort of uh, synergize with the new weapon, with the new weapon that you're using. But now you can just use the weapon without having to need the elite specialization. Ah, I see. So any downside with that? Mm, no, not really. That's I mean, cool. it's not going to be as uh, advanced uh, gameplay until you get the uh, elite specializations unlocked. But you get new weapon uh, abilities. Oh, cool, so, cool. you can use a rifle now. Ah, yes, but I won't be very awesome with it then. Uh, that depends. Mm, all right. Because so, the rifle is mostly used for a uh, stationary, uh, well, to uh, sit down so you can uh, do maximum output. But, well, unless you get somebody else around taking all the crap on uh, himself, it's not gonna be pretty pretty useful with it. Mm, all right. So basically, you can use it, but you won't be proficient in it. Well, I mean, not as proficient as well to get the full specialization. Mm. But uh, since since you're using guns, even uh, well, 
guns are actually better because they have more uh, mobility than the gun. Mm. All right, all right. So, all right. One more question. Why the hell are we on a beach? Why? Because yeah, I do. this is the, our vacation spot, but not I, this is the organization. I don't remember coming here. Well, it's been about two months. Yeah, but I don't remember coming here. I remember we were being in town. Did we? Are we? Were we? <laughs> well, I think we were for a bit, but that was just uh, for the bank and stuff. Wait, so so we we, we came here? I, I... Yeah. How much do you previous? How much do you previously remember of the story? What we were doing? Um. Okay. To be fair. To be fair to the audience at home. Uh, we were mostly leveling me up for the next story part. So as you can see, we're at level 60 now. So that means we're ready to continue on with the major story event. But beyond the story, uh, last I remember we were fighting pirates and saving the Duke's daughter. And now she's becoming an assassin like us. Yes. That's about it. Yes. Oh, um, we, we fought rats, or rats joined us. We helped rats. Yeah, we, we helped we rats. We helped rats against the dragon minions that attacked their folks. Yeah, yeah, that. And I think that's about it? Yeah, it should be. Alright, so... Okay, you see, today's gonna be fun. What's up? What's up? Oh, you're gonna see. We still remember our old friend Tibbles, right? Uh, Tibble, that's the big cat person? Yeah. Alright. Do you remember him? Okay. The engineer with the crooked, crooked arm. He's the one that was with us when we were first recruited into the Order of the Whispers. Yeah, I can kind of remember him. Wow, there's a lot of rats. Lots of rats. But not the ones that you remember. Oh, okay. Enter instance, yes. So, how how are you liking the new uh, expansion? Well, pretty good actually. Hmm. It's good, all right. I think. I think. Oh, uh, you didn't accept an invite. We weren't in the same group, so I'm not with you. <laughs> oh no. Um, should I go back? Uh, yeah. Let's see. I I I do see. Wait. Oh. Uh, you're in, I think. Just press, uh, just pre uh, press F to travel. X to tra F to travel. Okay. Return. All right. So, haha, we we we're derping. But anywho, yeah, you were saying about the story for um chapter three, or oh, not really chapter three, but for expansion three. Well, okay. Uh, go away. You can go in now. All right. Well, for expansion, well, so far it is good, but I can't finish it yet. Basically, uh, since the whole uh, dr um, Elder Dragons uh, thing uh, ended with the previous expansion, now there's something else going on. We got demons all over the place opening portals. But we're gonna get to that eventually. Hopefully. Someday. Right. In the distant future. Uh. All right, then. So, where's Tibble? Oh, there he is. Wait, what? We have a situation of critical importance. We've lost contact with Yang Isen, one of our agents in Lion's Arch. I fear he's gone rogue and turned against us. If so, we 
could be taking a lot of secrets with him. The very heart of the order is in jeopardy. I plan to send two of our best operatives to track Yang down. Was Yang aware of the Master's true identity? I don't think so, but it's possible. We had to trust Yang a great deal in order to move him into a prominent position in the city. Agent, it's time to promote you to Lightbringer, our highest class of operative. Congratulations. Too bad it comes on the heels of such trouble. <laughs> We're relying on you to handle this situation. No trouble that Tybalt and I can't handle. If Yang Isens betrayed the Order, we'll see he never shares what he knows. Real. Brief the operatives, then return to Lion's Arch and continue in your guise as the Commodore's assistant. Keep an eye out for anything unusual. By your will, Precinct. Like I said before, what's up with that dress? <laughs> uh, I don't know, maybe she's just wearing, uh, what do you call it, uh... What do you call the, ske uh, the skeletons for the airships and stuff? Uh, oh, skeletons? Or frames? I Yes, yeah, frames, <laughs> but... Wait, wait, I... Uh... She's wearing corset with a frame. Yes. What can I do for you? Okay, you know what? Never mind, let's continue on. <laughs> what do we do? Yes, ma'am. Talk to her. Not you, person. You. <clears throat> your last mission was dangerous. Are you certain you're up for another so soon? Um. Uh, it's kind of you to worry, but we can handle anything. Absolutely, the world won't save itself. The dragons aren't going to stop just because I get injured. I'm ready. Uh, you know, I'm gonna go for this one. Your confidence is admirable. Your sense of humor is even better. What's the mission detail? Yang is the keeper of beasts in Lion's Art. Whether for, uh, whether for Black Alley Pit fights or the Grand Gladiator Pits, he's your man. That gives him a lot of access to prestige, doesn't it? What's Keeper? So this is getting more info? Yeah. Uh, that gives him a lot of... Uh, uh, the... Person that is responsible for training fighters animal fighting animal use. Okay, cool. <laughs> Precisely, but it also makes him a target for anyone disappointed in the fight. Yang is missing and he has many enemies. Got it. Good luck, like bring I. Thank you. We'll keep you posted. Da -da -da -da. Okay. Press button and go? Okay. One thing I do like about Guild War 2 is its story. It's very uh, intriguing. Yeah, especially here at the start when you're basically new to the story. Okay, let's uh, teleport to Lion's Arch. The Traitor's Forum. Uh, Lion's Arch... No, that's Divinity Bridge. Uh, See where the green mark is. Oh, yeah, that, that, that. We only have one. Oh, we have two, we have two waypoints. Okay, oh. clean the cloak. Okay, that's Lion's Heart. This one? The gateway help us yeah. All right. Cool. The, the story overall is very intriguing. And also since, what, there's four classes, was it? Oh, uh, sorry. They're not. They're not count as classes, right? Um, the story is based on, um, race. Race, yeah. But wait, all the story leads to this point, or no? I remember all the story leads to based on what your pick was, right? Yeah, but eventually all the stories will come together. Yeah, but it, the the journey to that point is still different, right? Yeah. So that makes things very interesting for replayability value. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh no! Stop. Okay. There you go. 
and don't forget to ship mom. Yeah. So where I am right now, how far am I from the quote unquote main story? Well, we're soon gonna get to the intersection of the main story. Hold on, just get a bit closer so you can get away from me. <clears throat> so, you're saying that the main story is pretty far away from me then? Not so far, but you'll see soon. Mm. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Suspicious activity! This house doesn't look suspicious at all. I'm sure everything is up and up. That was the Lord of Yeah. I'm sure it's safe and nothing suspicious or bad is going to happen. Ow. So while waiting, have you catch the new One Piece movie? Sorry, um, One Piece uh, Netflix series? Of course I did. The, that was like the biggest bust in the last uh, three weeks. <laughs> okay. Man. All right. Here we go. Okay. The bit has been slept in recently. It's unmade. The wardrobe contains heavy leather clothing. The kind mercenaries and animal people wear. Noted. The diaries. The ledger contains a detailed list of features of the radar captured features. So, look at the column mark captured features. Uh, Yang captured rock dog, breeze, and da, da, da. Features. So, there's only a very... Okay. Oh. Wait, are we attacking the... And used to put on big gladiatorial contests with his beasts. I heard he even sponsored a few of the old Destiny's Edge bouts. This must be where Yang kept his monsters. He took really good care of them. Better than his employees, that's for sure. No sign of him, though. Would he abandon all these animals to starvation? No way. Like I said, Yang liked animals better than he liked people. He was always looking for new creatures to train. I wouldn't be surprised if he finally found something he couldn't tame. Very possible. Maybe something in the cages will give us a clue to what's happened to him. Huzzah! Whoa, beast to kill. Wait, the basilisk? Fuck that shit. Ah, uh, I knew this was gonna happen.
Look at them run. Whatever is down here is not good. Oh no. Dragon minions. I am trying to figure out my buttons. It's been a while. For me, but not for you. Oh, really? It's okay, I guess? I'm still trying to figure out buttons. <laughs> One is for auto attack, two is for uh, slowing your enemy, three is for uh, barrage. Yeah, I, I, I get that, but I'm trying to find buttons for my barrage thing because I think I caught, uh, I, I caught T it, but I don't remember which button. Is it this one? Give me a second, maybe I should hot T it now because that seems like a good button. Uh, let's see, where's that? Oh boy, okay, uh, game up. Controls, yes, controls. Skill three, where's skill? Oh, I didn't put skill three. Oh no, skill three is. Uh, M or no, how, how does one. Oh no. Uh, uh, F is for your uh, direction. Okay, done. <clears throat> oh no. Well, he's so scared. Oh no. Arisen. Oh, we're done? Not really. But Orion. That monster was from Orn. It can't be. Not here. Not in Lion's Arch. Calm down. Have you seen one of those before? It's really rare. Some kind of special scout. I read about the only other sighting of one when I worked the file room. Lightbringer. That operative saw it in Fort Stalwart just before Zaitan's minions wiped out the town. Zaitan only sends them when he's about to send in his whole army. Lion's Arch is in danger. Tybalt, are you absolutely sure about this? Trust me. We need to warn the Lion Guard. Meet me at their fortress on Claw Island, and let's hope we're not too late. What's on Claw <laughs> Island? Claw Island fortress stands in the harbor of Lion's Arch. It's the last defense against invasion from the sea. Zaitan's going to attack the city. Its minions will have to fight their way past the fort. Oh no! Yeah. That doesn't bode well. That's very bad. Can we loot corpse? <laughs> Can we do what? Loot the corpse. <laughs> I've been playing too much. No, I've, I've been seeing too much, uh, what you call this, uh, Baldur's Gate 3. Anyway, uh, which is best? How will perception? 
Power <laughs> Precision. I think it's gonna be the same. Yeah. Damage condition? Ferocity. Ferocity is my damage? Ferocity is the. Uh, well, no, let me check this again. No, ferocity is the critical damage. Alright, I'll take this one then. Yay! And Button. Really, right? Alright, go. <coughs> that was interesting. Well, hold on to your pants. Things are about to get nasty. Okay, let's just teleport to the Fort Mariner that's a bit south of Lion's Arch. Oh no! Top character! <laughs> Stop! Yeah. Uh, Lion's Arch. We're here. Fort Mariner. Fort Mariner. Uh, I don't. The one that's just. It's a bit north. There we it's go. Ah, uh, I haven't go to that waypoint yet. I'll be here. Yeah, that's the one I mean. Some reason it put you on a different player than me. Oh, uh, oh, different character? No, on a different play. Oh. I thought it was weird that I saw you moving, but I didn't register the default. Okay, I'm here. All right. Let's go! Woohoo! <laughs> Alright, I was distracted by that! <laughs> yeah, I know. They were, they were having good conversation, but it was fun. <clears throat> the creature we found hadn't been in Lion's Arch long. We may soon have time. Pacify the watchtower. Convince him to ready the defenses. <clears throat> All right. I don't like it. Something's definitely wrong with it. You and the cats are feeling it. <laughs> that Traherne up there talking to Commander Talon? What do you mean? Traherne, the necromancer? He comes through here every few months to see Ford. This guy creeps me out. The search that took you away from us was needlessly. The horrors of this right here. Or oh. Thank you for meeting with us, Watch Commander Talon. 
we have great news. One of Zaitan's minions breached the city. We destroyed it, but the creature was likely scouting for a much bigger force. An attack is imminent. A what? That's extremely unlikely. We've seen no sign of an impending attack. If there was to be one, we'd know of it. Tybalt left Paul. It is you, my friend. I should have known your order would be aware of the danger. Cards and gears. It's Traherne. We're lucky you're on the island. Convince this guy that we're serious. First, let me introduce you to my partner. One of the truest and most loyal friends I've ever had. Lightbringer, this is Traherne, one of the Silbari firstborn. Mysterious foremost scholar on Zaitan and Or, and a friend of the Order. A fleet of dead ships has launched from the Straits of Devastation. The risen sail beneath a cloak of stealth. Whatever you've seen, it can't be a real threat. Claw Island can withstand any assault. Speak with my commander, Drac and Mira. Review our defenses. You'll realize there's nothing to fear. Your hubris will be your downfall, sir. On alert. The Orions are planning a major attack against Claw Island. Tell the Watch Commander Talon that the gunnery emplacements are ready. The port here on Claw Island houses more 24 pounders than a ship of the line. He'll be ready to fight the Orions. Don't doubt that. Your content will be nil. I see cards at the beach for both of you. The Lion Guard don't see this coming. This won't be a small fight. It'll be a massive one. I just jump over here. Oh! Oh no! <laughs> Welcome to Hunter Helpful, the most dangerous duty on Claw Island. Deputy, a massive attack is on its way from Thor. You must prepare your troops. If we fall, our last order is to light those three signal fires. We have to warn Lion's Arch of the forces he's led. In a hundred years, they've never once been late. We're very proud of you. Deputy Mira, sound the alarm. There are undead on the beach. Get them in ready. Uh huh. Huh. Oh, over there. Okay. Testing your defenses. More will come, and soon. Take care. Report to Watch Commander Talon. Tell the men to be ready. Well done. I studied Orion creatures in the ancient Cold War. I've rarely engaged in combat with them. I was taught to command the way with these things. All my life, I've been drawn to these creatures. My wild hunt has appealed to me. Wait, where do we get up there? Oh yeah, by the way, if you play a Silvar, you're gonna encounter Traherne right at the start in most of your uh, story, your uh, levels. Oh, cool. Yeah. Watching the sea. You're a scholar, not a general, firstborn. Why should you trust me? Your hubris will be your downfall.
Ha ha! That shit makes no sense. <laughs> oh, okay, now it does. It's an undead snitch. Oh, there we go. We're done? Alright. We done here? Looks like it. Yeah. Oh no! Ah, there! Wait, we have to regroup. Alright. <laughs> well done. I'm gonna launch it. All right, go ahead, man. You need a bit more precision, and I'm not sure if we're gonna fit in the first try. Oh, there's more down there. Shoot. No, later, later, later. Come on, skip, skip. Yes. Oish. Oh dear. Oh no. One ship, now we've got tech. Go. They're everywhere. Yep. Yeah, Don't bother killing them, they're just gonna respawn. Oh, okay. 
Oh, I forgot. We need to talk to this idiot. Oh, he's dead? He just got killed. Medic! We need a medic over here! Commander Talon, hold on! You'll be alright. <laughs> Quiet, Mira! Soldiers don't need lies. Retreat to the city. Tell the Commodore. We did all we could. By your will, Commander. I swear to you, this <laughs> isn't over. Mira, the island is overwhelmed. We have to evacuate the Lion Guard and ignite the watchtowers to warn the city. No, you'll never make it to the beacon with these risen monstrosities chasing you. We'll have to fight our way back. The Lion Guard will make a stand in the courtyard while you go for the tower. God's willing, the risen will be too busy fighting us to stop you. Your bravery is commendable, Deputy Mirror, but your soldiers cannot survive a protracted battle against this many undead. It's the duty of every Lion Guard to lay down our lives to protect our city. If that's what it takes, that's exactly what we'll do. We'll rally in the courtyard. You light the warning beacon. Now go! Okay. Wait. Okay. If this point's going on, just kill this one. Oh, okay. Let's kill them! No, don't go into the. Go, don't go there. They're just gonna come back. Oh, they. You can't turn this time on this time the one there. You need to light the beacons. Just run. I'll run back to the courtyard. Okay. There we go. Oh no, I'm down. Thank you. Oh no, that's not good. That's a dragon. Yeah. 
You want to know what's the funny part about this? What? That's just a minion. Oh, <laughs> god damn. Oh, uh, uh. Damn, oh, whoa, oh, fool. All right. Damn, what do we do? <laughs> Run. That's the only thing we can do. Quick through the main gate. <laughs> Don't fight back, just run. The dragon's servants will never let our ship sail. Face around the docks, they'll slaughter us. Shaitan forces will grow. Our soldiers are too injured to fight. They can barely walk. We can't form a defense and still get them all aboard. I haven't always lived bravely. I think... I think I'd like to die again. What? Tybalt, what are you planning? After I lost my hand, I joined the Order of Whispers. Because the Char thought I was useless. Nobody needs a shaky engineer. I said I wanted to fight the dragons, and I did. Then I spent six years as a researcher. Never facing my fears. Never even trying. Nobody believed I had courage. Not even me. And then you came along. <coughs> you trusted me then, my friend. I need you to trust me now. I can do this. Go! There's no time to argue. Just believe in me. I've done a lot of things wrong in my life. <coughs> this one thing. Oh no, what will he do? Oh no! I will stop! Oh no! Oh well. Run, run, just run, run, run! I can't mount my dinosaur. <laughs> ah. That was a disastrous defeat. <laughs> I mean, it was the fall of the person. <laughs> his hubris was his downfall. <laughs> what? His hubris was his downfall. Yeah, but even so, even if he wasn't, this was unavoidable. <laughs> I mean, when if if he took our if we took heed of our warning, things could have. Gone slightly better? I don't know. <laughs> I mean, they were prepared for an attack and they still were all of them with superior numbers. Power position, power position, ferocity, power position. Yeah, just pick the middle one. <clears throat> Alright then. Yay. Oh yeah, and you got mail. I got mail. Happy birthday? Why? Oh, for... Error. This is just in the shop. <laughs> yeah. Oh no. Got a lot of dice. Okay, right, you got this one. 
Uh, All right, do it. I made something. <laughs> oh yeah, you got better shoulders. Uh, I took a guess. Yeah. You got one more. Uh, more die over there, the blue blocker. Open this? Yeah, you might as well. <laughs> oh. Where do you want? Okay, if you're gonna start the knot, you can use this uh, pink thing. To automatically give you twenty left. Ah, okay. We can we can hold for a bit. So use this. I know this is good. Yeah, this one. Is this also good? No. Huh, all right. Yeah, is that about all? Oh yeah, and uh, use that uh, woman that's over there in the set of the bed. This one? The second bed. The woman. Oh, this one. Yeah. Double click, summon mini, follow you around. Oh, okay. Or just right click and just add it to the list. Oh. Yeah. Now you can summon a pet to follow you around. <laughs> Okay. Oh no, my bag's getting full. Which one was yeah, you it? Don't, you don't. Most of this is the, the gradable, but you don't. Oh, you have 10 uh, in the last bag. Ouch, kid. I see. Oh god. Okay. Go to the last bag. Last. Uh, salvage kit. Salvage kit. Uh, minus tech. This one? Yes. No, just right click and it will salvage whatever. Salvage Which? all final left. You can only select it. You can select that. Huh. You can never have too much treasure. Oh no. <laughs> oh look, you get ninety three magic points. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> uh, <39. laughs> uh my selfish kid is done, right? Yeah, you're gonna have to buy a new one. Let's go to Oh, let's just go to the trader forum. We're gonna have to go there. Anyway. The trader forum. Oh yeah, and you can deposit that pink uh, level up thing in your bank, so it doesn't clutter. This is the bank, so I'll go here then. All right. So, are we done with it? Yet? Or do we have still more? I feel like we have more, right? There's, yeah, there's more. All right, just to drop. Stuff off. All right, let's do this. So we were talking about One Piece, right? Yeah. Uh, how long is one episode, by the way? Uh, not counting the uh, end credits, it's about forty-five minutes. Ah, so about an hour long. Do you feel like it's a good show to review, even with Silver on? I mean, we could try, but how would we go about it? Do we just do uh, one episode, or do we do a couple seasons or something? Hmm, I don't know. I mean, 
technically each show is about an hour long. So eight hours. I not sure. Need to ask Silver if he's watched it or not. Or if he's even interested in watching it. He probably would be. Hmm. I mean if he's interested that's good. But if he's not then I guess we can do something about it on our own. Bang, bang, here. Here? No? Yes? Yeah. Yes. So where are you going? Turn back. Oh, Get no. Yes. Bank? Where's Bank? Oh god, there's so many people. Just get closer to the cluster and uh, stop. Oh, there we go. Okay, just put the, the... Yeah, uh, put this up. And also the XP things. This and the bottom one. And... Wait, what was that uh, voucher thing that's over there? Right. Which one? In the second bag, you get the, some kind of paint. What's that? Oh, we'll put this in the bag. Okay. Oh, uh, you can open a chest since you got uh, the key. Uh, which chest? This one? Or this one? This one. So, use? Yeah, this is the wardrobe right with it. Uh, wardrobe. wardrobe, all right. That's all the stuff. There we go. Put this in the bank. Now you already have a stack. Mm -hmm. put, put it on the same stack as the, the one that you already have. Oh no, this one. Oh, uh, oh this one. They don't also do it? Oh man. Well, you could just double click it and it will automatically put it in since this is the uh, bank. <coughs> also, put that weird square thing inside. This one? That's on the first back. Yes, that was what I was trying to put it inside. That's about it. That's about it, eh? Alright, double checking. Grab the salvage kits. All right. And where can you get the salvage kit? Over here. Let's see what I can sell first. Sell junk. Not much. Uh, sell this kit. Ah, there we go. Alright, let's see. Just right click it. Uh, in the first bag. Fine and lower? Yeah. I mean, that's your new only the only thing that's this. Oh, yeah, and you've got two more things in the last bag. Two more things last bag. This one? No, I mean in the last bag in the inventory. Eight slots in usable bag. Oh. Are these plants better? Uh, hmm, looks like it, but uh, it's just the defense, so it's not worth it. Just All right, go away with them. <clears throat> okay, 
Amen. The, the blue or gold red thing in the first bag. This one or this one? No. Uh, the one that's uh, yellow and red. Yellow and red. This one. No. Go left. You fan too far. Oh, yeah, also you too. Okay. You see that uh, uh, black key that you got? Black, okay. Go right. That's it. This one, double click it? Open. Yeah. Oh. Let's see, that should be about this. You can also salvage the yellow one since you're not using them anyway. Uh, the yellow one, this one? No, uh, the one that's been injured. And this one. Shoulders. Yes. Mm, okay, so I'll just salvage these two then. You on. And that one. This. Oh, yeah, I also remember something that did change with the new expansion. Uh, the rooms, the Chiral level rooms that you use to get some special bonuses have been removed and just re replaced with flat out stat increase. Oh. And now you can just uh, uh, get those spe uh, special abilities with, uh, well, you sort of get them. You see, open your inventory again. You see that chest? This one? Yeah. Open, open it once. Oh. Okay, so this is basically what you get for uh, conditions for uh, damage over time. Power is for well, flat damage. Support is for helping others, and surround is for well, giving you ba uh, better durability. You you basically just take the power that comes with it. Okay. Okay. Now open this. Oh, and if you pick one of the one, one of the relics. Oh, relic of thievery. Yeah. Well, well, you need to check what it does actually. Go over it. Uh, go on the icon. Oh, okay, icon. Right. Upon striking an enemy with a weapon. Skill that has a recharge or resource cost gain one percent strike damage or six uh for six seconds up to maximum five stack. Uh, yeah, and this this is for you. Yeah, <laughs> obviously. Yeah, since you kept the the what was it the guns that you're using for yeah. So yeah, this is this and equip it. Equip it? Oh, cool. All right, now with that little detour out of the way, let's continue. All right, I hope I'm more powerful now. Should be. Well, speaking of which, I forgot that I, I was supposed to do that. <laughs> let's just uh, let's just continue. All right. You ready? Uh, yeah. This should be fun. Oh, yeah, you, you were right. I, I was going to enjoy this one. A lot of action. <laughs> yeah, and now we have to deal with the after, aftermath of, well, undead invasion. Ah. I miss the old Lion's Arch. 
it was fun and hip. <laughs> Actually, if you do the uh, certain achievement chain for uh, season first of the uh, what was it? World season, you can get actually get the night, and that's gonna take you to uh, old version of life. Mm, okay. Now then, are we all assembled? Yeah, hey, let's talk. Lightbringer, I've heard rumors that Tybalt left Pi is dead. Can you confirm? You have been proud of his bravery recently. If he hadn't stood the line. We wouldn't have escaped. Tybalt didn't think he had any courage, but he proved himself wrong in the end. Tybalt's courage saved our lives, and your leadership <coughs> brought us to safety. I'm in your debt, Lightbringer. If I can be of service, say the word. I'll never forget Tybalt, but now duty calls. The Lion Guard is evacuating the populace. The Dermond Priory safeguards the harbor, and the vigil musters at Fort Mariner. Very well. We need more information. Each Lightbringer will patrol a section of the city for his I-10 scouts. I'll take Canal Ward. Undead will be coming out of the sea. If they're sending scouts, I'll find them there. Good. <coughs> we need a complete sweep, Lightbringers. Watch for anything strange, but stay alert for danger. the bank oh really Oh no, I'm down. Thank you. Oh, I'm out of here. Oh, I need I need to work on the R button. So annoying. Oh, shoot, that's big. Yeah. Please help us. We got messages from our parents. It's horrible out here. Monsters everywhere. Don't let them meet us. Look out. Here they come again. Lightning servants will be approaching by water. Oh, where did they come from? God dang it. We good? We good?
I'm so squishy. Yeah. I also find, I don't know, for some reason, the undead uh, get really, you know, tired at this part. There were creatures in the city, but Traherne and I destroyed them before they did much damage. Well done, Lightbringer. The other operatives are still finishing up, but I suspect they'll find the sand. Preceptor, it's time to face reality. The Order of Whispers can't be expected to hold back Zaitan alone. We need to exploit our connections. I agree. Preceptor Dawn, I know you have leverage on many talented individuals. I suggest you put it to use. Ben Tenstrikes refuses to divulge my whereabouts to my father, so the Ministry has tossed him into prison for his trouble. He'd help us if he still lives. I have an alternative, Preceptor. We are currently sheltering an assurance scientist named Gore. His inventions would be an advantage. Both are sound plans. Lightbringer, I want you to recruit one of them. Your choice. Whichever you decide, I'm going with you. You could use the help. And I owe it to Tybalt. Hmm, okay, so... Um... Which one do you pick? All up to you. Uh, which one did you pick? Uh... I don't know, I... I for... I don't remember when was the last time when I did... Uh, this is a kill because these missions are differ also based on uh, what race you are. Oh, okay. Okay, so go for the human asshole or go for the cookie scientist person. Hmm. Both sound fun. You know what? I'm gonna go for the scientist. Wait, is okay. that the girl that we kind of saved before? Yeah, that Demi, the one we helped to rescue. Ah. And, uh, the guy that she suggested was the one who helped her uh, get out of the city. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, I, I feel like the scientist is much more fun because we could get more weapons, I think. Okay. Let's go. Uh, yes, very dangerous. Uh, it operates on a theory that the Dane the dragons consume magic as they consume flesh and even stone. This weapon hits them where in the gullet. Ah, okay, give me a second. Uh, da, 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 da. What happened? When the gen who helped me escape, my father the, found out that uh, locked him up. Okay. The uh, uh, yeah. my father doesn't like to be outsmarted. Um, now after reading, I want to save Ben. <laughs> okay. Man, I don't know. Like this one seems like it will, but this one, eh, fuck it. I, I, I'm a good guy. I, I'll help. We need to help Ben. We need to. We need to help Ben ten. <laughs> <laughs> it really is bad. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Woo! I'm so glad you're with us, Ben. I'm so happy to see us. It's home too, Mary. We can keep things safe here. It's hard to do this alone. I'll stand with you. <clears throat> Oh no. <laughs> yes, this, this, this obviously. <laughs> this, this is more powerful. Come again? Uh, previous thing. Okay, uh, power condition. 
healing. <coughs> Sorry, condition damage. Power toughness bite. This one? Let's go Steve Ben 10. <laughs> uh, the spelling is not the same, but it's so close, man. So, now we go back to Queen Tail. Beetle King. He was second before that. I, I just want to double check. Oh, wow. Oh wow! Um, it, yeah, it, this one's better. So... Equip to main hand. Okay. And equip this two off. That's very confusing. Why? Because uh, I I don't know what I'm looking at. And it, it says everything's green. It doesn't show much. Well, you, well it, it shows information on the top of the icon. Main hand and the bottom one says off. Yeah, but it says green and whatnot. And uh, I, I guess, yeah, that's true. The green is the one that's uh, the increase. It's okay. Never mind. Anyway, um, where do we go now? Uh, we go to Queensland to Beetle. Let's -a go. Woohoo! Oh, this place is busy. What place? Uh, Queens. So you're still in Lime's Arch. Oh. See where the star is. Oh, there we go. But wait, hold on. No. This is the close ah, port. Crap. Hold on, I need to rest restart the computer. Something went wrong. Oh no, I'll, I'll be the star then. Yeah. <coughs> oh wow. All right. So you you. You'll be leaving me for a bit then? I think he already has. Alright, while he restarts his computer, I'll check out my new toy. Ooh! Hmm, fascinating. Let's see, let's see. Uh Hello there. There was a time I had greeted you with a simple, uh, with a sample of my family's wine. Unfortunately, now 
I can only bid you welcome if only I could get my vineyard. That's a shame. Uh, no, no time. Oh no. I don't think I'll pause for a bit. And we are back. Yay. Um, I'm not 100% sure if we are really back or not, but we done stuff. I, I don't think it was caught on camera. If it does, uh, it was a bit boring. But anyway, uh, we're back. Your PC problems are all fixed. Now let's continue back to the quest. It's here, right? Yeah. Just around the corner. Yes. <clears throat> Traherne, good to see you. Before we begin, Breaking someone out of prison doesn't bother you, does it? Although I do not lightly break the law, our need is desperate. The Legate Minister will simply have to forgive. Forgiving isn't one of Minister Cotticus's strengths. We'll need to be sharp. We'll need to be cautious. We need to get in, but the entrance is guarded. If they raise an alarm, the operation is over before it begins. Stay close to me and keep quiet. <clears throat> Yeah, stay close to me and be quiet. Oh, I'm I'm sure we'll be very very quiet. Um, yes, love the guard. Halt! State your name and intent. Um. Delta, I guess. I guess. I don't know. Um. Uh, turn back to. Uh, uh, okay. Uh, let's try again. I guess. Oh no, we relief. <clears throat> I don't make the schedule. Uh. Wow, they're dumb. And now, the stealth game begins. Yay, we're playing Metal Gear! Look at those guards. They're jumpy, watchful, far more than usual. Those aren't ordinary ministry guards. A minister knows something. If a guard spots us, he'll call for others. We would do well to avoid them. So that's the location we need to go? Alright. Yeah. There's no crouching, right? Nope. No walking, right? Man, this Just is dumb. Wait for this to pass. Hold on, this one's coming back. Let's see if I can change the point of view. Alright, I think... Uh, let's see. Uh, Pastor, what is it? Uh, I'll try Demi. Brown. Brown. What? Wow, works? Shit! Oh no! Get in. Stay outside. 
Wait, what? Why am I using... Oh, you know what? Okay, I, I guess... Suddenly, I changed to my swords. Oh, wait, what? Oh, you pressed that, uh, other button. Still the key, I remember, right? Woohoo! Ben 10! Take your head in front of the ministry. <clears throat> I ain't telling you where she is. Go ahead, hit me again. It just tickles. Easy, Ben. We're friends. Nobody's hurting you anymore. We're getting you out of here. You. I know you. You're from the Order. Good to know. They haven't totally forgotten about me. Not a chance. To me, sends her regards, by the way. Come on, let's go thank her together. Demi. Brave, clever girl. Couldn't let her stay in a place like this. Where's Tybalt? He should be here. He should. He'd be here if he could. Now come on. Time enough for questions later. His wounds are severe. Ben may be impressive, but he can't fight like this. We'll have to fight for him. You go first and clear the way. I'll follow with Ben. Okay. So, stuff gameplay over? Mm, I wonder, hold on. Just in case, wait for this one to pass. I don't see the circle anymore, so that means we can... Oh, that's us. That's not fair. They're hitting us in cutscenes. Don't backtrack into that. You know what? Let's try and just escape. See what happens. Yeah. Don't try going through the main door. You won't get.
Not there. Leave me be. That wasn't my smoothest exit ever, and I won't complain. I owe you two my life. As for anything in my power, and it's yours. I hope you mean that, Ben. Zaitan's forces threaten Lion's Arch. Claw Island's already been overrun, and Tybalt died to save our lives. Son of a gun. Never thought old Tibbs would go out a hero. I like that guy, though. He always made me laugh. We need you and your mercenaries. Zaitan will be ready for the orders. But you're a wild card it can't predict. You know my weak point. Completely unnecessary flattery. <laughs> Let me get my wounds tended. <clears throat> then I'll pull my mercs together. We'll be there. Thank you, Ben. I knew we could count on you. See you on the docks of Lion's Arch. Lightbringer, the Orions are firmly entrenched. It will be incredibly difficult to regain Claw Island. We can't give up hope, Traherne. I haven't. In fact, I'm counting on hope to lead the way. To that end, we should ask for wisdom from the Pale Tree. If anyone knows how to defeat Zaitan, it is the Mother. Meet me at the Grove, and we'll speak with her before the battle. Yay, most likely. Oh, what? Harpoon? Oh, no. How oh, precision? Assassin's Heart Harpoon, Rampage, the Spear. Huh. This one, I guess? Uh, I suppose. Now we're gonna go to Treherne's mama. <laughs> All right, where's that? Um, da, 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 this one here, yeah, really? Yeah, no, no, this is this is just uh, it's a portal, it means we you have to go through there. But honestly, just let's just go to the lion's arch because you zoom out and you can see where it is. Oh, this it's one. Further. Oh, I don't have anything there. Shit. Yeah, but we're gonna use the teleport on the portal from the Lion's Arch. So just go there. Lion's Arch. I forgot Lion's Arch. Where I am. The blue dot. You're here, right? Yeah, just go here. <laughs> Okay. I can go to the portal. <laughs> ah, yeah. This is where the Solvar is. Hmm.
Oh, the loading so long. Yeah, I don't know what is it. Didn't even I'm holding. There we go. Oh no, we're on air. Oh, there we go. Hail, Mother. We seek your wisdom. Bide a while. I have much to show you both. Come to me. Let me show you the way. Doctor. Mother Tree, I am sure by now you have heard of the destruction at Claw Island. Zaitan is attacking in force. The soul of Tyria mourned as her children were cut down by the beast. The land wept, and the world shuddered. My friend and I seek to right that wrong. We wish to fight Zaitan, and take back what was lost. We've come to ask your counsel. The answer is at the heart of Tyria's future, and your own. Both of you must face the darkness, become guiding stars in the night. Is it even possible to defeat Zaitan? Only with great courage. Come, I will show you a vision of your future and the challenges to come. Huh. It is time, my brave friends. Your future awaits. And before that, true, uh, go to oh, no, sorry. Uh, never mind, we're gonna do it when we get out. Oh, I was excited to see my future. Oh, oh no, this is bad. I want to go back. Even though I have been here, in truth, this vision. We're in the ruins of war. The pale tree has lessons yet to be revealed. This is where Zeit and the undead dragon leaders. It's where his army scouts from. From a sunken city. So we're supposed to talk to these people? No, these are just images. There's a title drop. <laughs> Aha! So let's go to the... this road lead mother to the ancient city of Ara, the dragon stronghold that is your goal along the way you will glimpse things that may yet come to pass oh, yes. yeah, be yes. careful oh. there's uh, living weapons oh Uh-huh. <gasps> 
Well, no, that was unexpected. Creatures are formidable, tougher than the ones at Claw Island. How will we defeat them? Alone, you cannot. But with unity, you will find that many impossible things can be achieved. That was generic. Very little lacks context. Defenders of Tyria, when Zaitan rose from slumber, the dragon found a long dead nation and claimed it. The dragon expected the rest of Tyria to be as easily conquered. But we live, and we breathe, and we fight. All races, all orders, and all paths of life stand against Zaitan. The dragon is a fearsome enemy. He wants nothing more than to paralyze us with. <coughs> But I tell you this, we are not afraid. We will never kneel. Do you feel that? The dragon hears us. To hurrah and victory. Is this a vision of the future? Mother, I do not understand. I'm no general. You must be what Tyrion needs you to be, my son. You have more courage than you realize. <laughs> And notice there's Vigil, there's German Priory, and the Order of Whispers. Ah! So let's just fight in this imaginary world and bring it to life later on. Yeah! I guess. <laughs> have fallen they must be redeemed you are the catalyst you must bring them together heal their wounds i think i know who they're talking about where were you we needed you i couldn't protect you i kept still screaming someone was going to die no matter what i did Snaff or my queen. I had to make a choice. You would have done the same. Any of you! If the person you loved was in danger, you would have done the same. Destiny's Edge disbanded after their loss against the Elder Dragon, Kalkatoric. To this day, they have unresolved grievances with one another. Your 
responsibility. Snap trusted you, and you failed him. I tried to keep him out of danger. I would have given anything to prevent his death. It wasn't enough. You weren't enough. You should have died heir instead of him. Logan was called away by his queen. Yet Air chose to fight the Elder Dragon. They lost. Lint died, along with Snaff, Surge's mentor and friend. I've tried so very hard. They can't stop arguing. They can't <coughs> understand that the dragons are more important. They throw everything away. Come back to me. If the world must end, let us spend our last days in each other's arms. These visions represent a possible future for Destiny's Edge, should they not resolve their quarrels. We need them to reconcile, if we're to defeat Zaitan. Okay. Mm oh, yeah, remember this bitch? Y yeah, I remember oh, her. Where was I? Oh yes, the Guild Wars. Still angry over the loss of Ascalon. I mean, <laughs> when you think about it, uh, they would just be whiny bitches who just don't want to talk to each other and have super egos. This is the tomb of the kings of Or. Walk inside and seek truth, but be warned, the future can change in the blink of an eye. To see the sky, feel once more the wind and the sun, although my nation is drowned. The slow blood still pulses in its veins. Or was once the heart of Tyria, so full of life. I was the last of a line of proud rulers. Now, my nation is enslaved. What do you seek here? Or has nothing left to give, save ash and bones. We came to fight Zaitan. Can you give us counsel? Zaitan can be defeated, but that will not save Or. The land must be cleansed of this poison. Seek the source. Is Zaitan the source, or is there some other poison that fouls ore? Please tell us. Seek the source. Cleanse ore. Seek the source. So, not gonna tell us where is it, eh? Asshole. I mean, it's just an image. It's not the real spirit. <laughs> Uh, I guess, I guess. It was Zaitan, the elder undead dragon that pulled ore from the depths. The <coughs> massacre of ore gave the dragon fertile ground to create its horrific army. Zaitan's power does not end here. In 
slaughter, its army grows stronger. War Island is just the beginning. The dragons are destruction. They will not stop until all life on Tyria is destroyed. Ooh. Your last challenge on the road to Ara will be the guardian of the gate. Beyond this, I cannot foretell. Once before, I gave this sword to a beloved son. Now, I pass it on to you, Trahan. Its name is Calipor. Bear it with honor, and the sword will never fail you. Test yourselves against the guardian, then return to me in the grove. Wow, fancy sword. Yeah. And you can get it some at some point later. Mmm. Cool. There's the gate guardian exactly. I see him. You ready? Let's go. I used to break his bar. Uh, you know which one's the stun, right? Yep, number two. No, that's the slow. Number stun is the four. Oh, he's done. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> so number four is the stun button. Yeah. All right. Cool. Now we know. Uh, what do we do? And now uh, another decision. Okay. All has all hope. To continue to confront the dragon, you must first overcome your greatest fear. Least to consume. Tell me what is your uh, that an innocent person who has lived in me would die because I couldn't save them. That I would feel so grieved that I lose the respect of my that one day through my actions I condemn someone. <coughs> Mm, nom, 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 nom. What do you fear most? Uh, number two, this one, because I don't give a, give a fuck about this one. Uh, like, oh yeah, my actions did someone. Okay, yeah, I, I don't really care. It's part of my job. This one, person, believe me. Yeah, you know what? You didn't have confidence in me in the first place. This one, oh no, oh no. I, this is this is bad. Okay. Uh. It is good to hold friends high regard, but better to live up to your own high ideas. Keep that in mind. Okay, cool. Uh, I feel like that will play a part in the future. To know the future, even what, the mere possibility can be a great <laughs> burden. I am sorry, brave heroes, that you must walk this path. Must these things come to pass, mother? Must I take up Caleb Bolg? and travel into the heart of Orr. You must both take up this mantle. Traherne, your duty is to cleanse Orr. Your friend shall aid you, and then face the dragon. And Claw Island, can we retake it and save Lion's Arch? I believe so, but that will not be your first test. 
The dragon seeks to destroy its enemies before they can strike. I <gasps> see within the dream that Zaitan's forces enter battle, not against Lion's Arch, but at the heart of your order. My order what? headquarters? No, how could that be? How could Zaitan even know? Those who have been corrupted reveal everything to Zaitan. Nothing is secret, least of all those places where his enemies hide. If my friends are in danger, I have to go to them. They have no warning. They'll be slaughtered. I will go with you. Our fates are bound together, and from this day forward, we fight as one. Farewell, valiant souls. May your wild hunt be successful, and may your courage illuminate the dark of night. <coughs> oh no! What's this? Uh, uh, these are uh, things. Was hmm. giving you a uh, a fifteen minute. Uh, uh, what was it? Fifteen minutes. Uh, uh, oh yeah, it summons uh, an NPC that gives you uh, access to a trading post uh, for fifteen minutes. This one's one bank. gives you access to the bank, and the other ones merchant. Hmm. So uh, I think bank one. What? The bank? I guess. What, what would you recommend? I don't know. You could take the third one which gives you uh, an access to a merchant. To sell stuff and... Uh, yeah, I, I guess that's much better because I could just sell stuff when I'm full. Yeah, yeah, that, that makes sense. Yay. Alrighty then. <clears throat> you know what, Jacob? Let's end it here for a bit because we have been doing this for two hours. Yeah, might as well. Yep. And I think this is a nice spot to end it because I feel like the rest of the chapter is going to be long. Is it? Feels like it. Hold on, let me just check something quick. Uh, critical evil rat. Oh no, the frame rate. Oh yeah, you know what? We, I suppose we can just end because the. The next uh, part's like really long. Yeah. Sort of really long. Yeah, you don't have to draw this stuff for now. Alrighty then. So, yeah. Any... Hmm? But, yeah. Uh, let's first just teleport to where we're gonna have to go uh, later anyway. Uh, back to where the order entrance is in the. Uh, what is it? Uh, Tombuff Isle? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Alright. Continue there for next time. Yep, yep. And also, we, we, we can save the frame rate because that place was crushing my computer. It seems like that's the case for just about every, every major city because there's so many people there. Mm hmm. Yep. Yay! Hmm, but anyway, yep, so that's it for today's session. So, if you guys enjoy the um, episode, do subscribe to the podcast or channel uh, to get more. Um, commenting and whatnot does motivate me to do more of this, so yay, let's do this. So, um, Jacob, where can the good people find you, man? Uh, you can find me on the DeviantArt under the username Yakapon Torkar, under the Twitter username Tales of the Ashes. If you're interested in reading the story Tomorrow Rising, you can find it on thinfiction.net. And if you're interested in reading an original story featuring anthropomorphic animals in a dual fantasy setting called Tales of the Ashes, you can find it on the Tales of the Ashes.com. 
awesome, awesome, awesome. We'll do so, guys, because his stories are really awesome. So anyway, um, if you uh, also please subscribe to us on iTunes, YouTube. Uh, don't forget to press the bell icon and stay up to date. And also, I need to update that because Stitcher Radio is dead. <laughs> so what are you uh, going to do now? Ah, man, surprisingly... Oh, right, you got Amazon. Yeah, surprisingly, Amazon exists. Wow. Uh, I'm not sure about... <clears throat> what What's the other thing? Um, That online music service... Spotify? Uh, Spotify, yeah. I'm not sure it's Spotify, but yeah. Um, I know we are on Amazon, um, Audible, so yay. Uh, go check us out, go check us out over there. Um, and yeah, th- that's about it. Uh, links will be in the show notes. Um, if you'd like to support the show, go do so at patreon.com slash mbs show. Uh, every support will, uh, will grant you access to, um, let's see. Uh, oh, wow. A week early access to the, Part, uh, to the review and discussion podcast exclusive and deleted content and a huge thank you from me lucky brother thank you so i'd like to thank jacob lucky knight and also myself like thank you so much guys you are great so anyway i have been norman sanzo i'm Jakob. and we'll see you guys next week with another fun episode on the show see ya